We've got our trail layer who's now walking in towards the hounds. That's Andy Horn. He's also in a, uh, a racehorse syndicate. And we've nine hounds who are going to uh, give you a demonstration. Uh, Andy's pulling a, a, a scented rag of aniseed and paraffin. And, you know, our puppies, they are, uh, they're trained to hunt this aniseed and paraffin scent for around six months. And, you know, there's no jockeys on these hounds' backs. So, you know, they've got to do it all by their scent and, and, and following the scent. And as you see them there on the screen, they're, they're heading away nicely, getting very well strung out. Uh, this is quite a, a short trail for these hounds as these hounds are often running distances of between six and up to about 11 miles. And they cover a variety of terrain, fields, fells, um, also rivers crossing, mount, you know, over the mountainous areas of, um, you know, the South Lakes. And as the hounds there, they've got a good shot of them. They're coming up towards us. It's Border Rain who's leading from Castle Clansman. Fire Lass in third there. Um, there's a, a, a wide gathering of other hounds there in behind them, but... You know, they're, they're getting away well. There's one or two who are struggling to keep the pace and they're kind of falling back behind. But, you know, these hounds are, are, are doing it all themselves following this aniseed and paraffin scent. Border Rain with its tail aloft there, the, the lighter of the two hounds from Castle Clansman. These ha Castle Clansman, Castle Callant are here representing Langham trainers. Good shot of the hounds there as there's two in, in, in a little bit of advantage and then there's another four or five there, very well grouped. Border Rain dropping his nose just to right himself for the scent. There's another hound that's uh, catching up now. White Hound joining Castle Clansman. That looks like Spring, Spring Remedy, a very locally trained hound just from, from over at Briscoe. They've got uh, Castle Callant in behind. And then we've got uh, Showbiz. And we've also got Minecraft. Then we've got Fire Lady. These hounds are getting on well. Border Rain and Castle Clansman who've been at the front from the start. They're both uh, pushing on well, border in, doing the majority of the work in front from the puppy hound, the lemon and white puppy hound that's second there. That's Spring Remedy. Another puppy hound in fourth there. That's uh, Minecraft. They're all pushing on well. These hounds stretching nicely. Like I say, they're, they're uh, used to running a far greater distance. These hounds run up to uh, around uh, 10 or 11 miles and they'll cover that distance in around 30 minutes. Um, we usually do have a bucket collection on this, this day annually. Um, however, they're a little bit of a thing of the past now. But what we would like to say is a massive thank you to all of the, um, the spectators who have given so generously over the years to these very worthy causes, the likes of the Injured Jockey Fund and the Great North Air Ambulance, etc., that we've raised money for. <laughs> Lovely shot of the hounds jumping the hurdle there with Border Rain still in front from Castle Cransman. Those two, a little bit clearer spring remedy, Castle Callant. Fire Lass, then we have Showbiz and the Puppy uh, Minecraft, then we've got Fire Dancer, a little bit of drift, and we've also got uh, another hound there who's uh, Fireball who's struggling to keep with the pace, but Border Rain seems to be the one who's going to take all the beating today as these hounds start to come up towards the last hurdle, Border Rain, and Spring Remedy is really trying to get to Border Rain now, Castle Clansman looking a little bit one-paced in third, Castle Callant in behind, Fire Last trying to get into the equation but Border Rain out in front as they come to this next hurdle, ladies and gents it looks like it's going to be Border Rain from Spring Remedy could be all in the jump, Border Rain took it well gave himself a couple of lengths there he's looking round in front but he's still in front Spring Remedy is coming behind him, it's going to be a very tight call, ladies and gents, Spring Remedy finishing well up the inside of Border Rain, but Border Rain holding on in front and he's going to stay in front until the line from Spring Remedy, Castle Clansman. And then there's another few hounds in behind. One or two of these hounds are struggling to be caught, they're very keen, they may go on again. Then we have uh, Fire Dancer and uh, Fireball who are bringing up the rear. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the uh, sport of hound trailing. So thank you very much for your time. Thank you very much for observing our sport. And again, thank you very much to Carlisle Racecourse for hosting this ev event again today. Watch live racing now on racingtv.com.